Okay, hello everybody, welcome back to Blackmore's Basement. Sorry for the slightly late start, uh, I was taking care of a couple things around the house. But I'm here, we're gonna switch over to Cassette Beasts and keep this story going. Stocked up on rewinds. We've got a respool. What the captain said is over here, as is the fiery dash ability, so we'll be going this way. Uh, how many tapes do I have? 15 basics, 5 chromes, a water filled, and 2 snake skin. Alright. I do apologize if at random it sounds like I'm eating. It's because I am. I got some uh, peanut butter toast next to me. I am a very hungry man right now. Hey, yo, Folklorn! Look at that dude! Oh, he looks sick! Probably a fault evolves from a, a Mac on a camera. Ow, dick. I didn't want to have to use those already, but I guess I have to. Uh oh. Hmm. Our faith can move mountains. Copper, 1720. Sorry, Cooper, not Copper. I'm an idiot. Copper chop!
The sharp point on a metal-type attack penetrates an earth-type target like a shovel, lowering its overall defense. Alright! So metal beats earth. Makes sense. Mountain smash? Man, I just re-spooled my fucking Dominoff! This is some nonsense! Fusion! Popper off! I love how the fusion system works. Although, to be perfectly fair, it should be called a mixtape. Charge just have priority? Uh. Thank goodness for revenge strike. But holy shit. Uh. Greater love has none no one than this to lay down one t one's tapes for one's friends. Dorian, 1513. Uh-huh, sure. Please there let there be a campsite nearby. I- Ah! Uh. Sorry! Poltergeist! That's just not working at all. Join the morning children for the food. Well, at least you're honest. Well, that looks like a switch. Aha! <gasps> Magic crab! There's a fast travel spot nearby. Hell yeah! Bloodlust, uncommon, automatically raises the user's melee and ranged attack stats when an opponent is defeated. Plus one duration, heals for 9% max HP. Funny little guys. Bulletino and Velosa Rifle? What? These names are great! I must have them.
Oh, I think I might have knocked out the Bolotino. Yeah, shit. Wait, what? Oh, ow. Landing a fire type attack on an air type target creates an updraft, an air wall that can absorb a number of incoming attacks. Oh, sweet! Well, thanks for the elemental wall, buddy! Alright, let's try a chrome tape. Recording! Oh, damn near 50. <laughs> ricochet? Sorry. The fuck is a ricochet? Wait, does multi shot? Does that thing have the ability to, like, go through walls? Because if so, that's actually kind of nuts. Recording! Come on! Stop targeting Kaylee, darn it! Ha ha! Knocked you out. That's a one hundred percent chance, baby. Got it. Velasa rifle. The back of Velasa rifle's skull contains a chamber filled with gunpowder that it can ignite at will, launching any projectile stored inside the barrel of its face. They have subsequently learned to have very good aim. Wow, that's a fast boy! 160 speed, 140 ranged attack? Whoop! Ricochet. Miscellaneous, the user's ranged attacks have a 50% chance to ignore opponent's walls. Woo wee! We gotta get you in the team, little buddy! We also got to get one of those Bulletinos. <laughs> right. Fire burns away poison and creates a black smoke. Switch it with black one so I can get away with doing some damage. Recording. Oh, guaranteed. Again, they always go for the guy who's recording. This is some nonsense. What? Gotcha! Bulletino. The Bulletino has only one defense mechanism, and needs to launch itself headfirst into danger when panicked. This is a bad idea, but the Bulletino does it anyway. That is a fast boy! 200 speed. Good guy. Bulletino Dash. You can now press B to perform a short dash. This consumes your stamina. But I can already do that. I am, idiot. Oh, that's fast. Okay. A five percent chance to flee. Oh boy.
have shooting star on swap. Nice. Well, all right then. Dog ears. All right, that's pretty good. Um, what is that? What is that? Sleeping? No, not at all. I was, um, uh, uh, meditating. I'm Zed, by the way. Mm. That's sad. It's getting real difficult to meditate around here. What with those bulletinos zooming around. Any chance you could sort that out for me? Uh, sure. I'll do that. I'll, I'll get around to that. Whee! Dang, that dash gives you some distance. Also eats your stamina. Metal, taunt, basic tape. All right. Hmm. That's ominous. Oh, a camp. Thank God. Hmm. So, tell me, how do, you, how do you feel about sleeping in the great outdoors? Uh, I'm more of an inside person. <laughs> That's unfortunate. You might have to get used to sleeping in a tent if you're going to be exploring the island. New World doesn't exactly have a local hotel franchise or anything. Yeah, not if the landkeepers have a say on it. Yeah, let's remaster Dominoff. Your Dominoff became Tokusect. Tokusects have extremely aer aerodynamic bodies, aiding a fighting style that is focused around using their pointed legs to strike opponents and channel powerful currents of air. Yeah! <laughs> and Sirenade. Sirenade became Decibel. Very few Decibels have been seen in the wild. Early denizens of New World whispering, whispered of seeing white dragons in the clouds, but it's unclear whether these were, they were seeing Decibels or just losing their minds. Now, Velocir Rifle is fantastic. And hey, he's already a vault? I guess he's already a remaster. Probably a Bulletino. I can see some design similarities, so I guess it makes sense. and an ethereal tape. An immaterial tape that has an annoying habit of sometimes passing through other objects. Tiny pinpricks of light, like far-off stars, can be seen throughout through its surface. It has a very high efficiency rate when used to record astral-type monsters. Hey, Magic Crab! Welcome! I've taken the liberty of opening Platform A for you to travel. Now, what can I do for you? Oh, yeah, I want to travel. Can you send me to the Harbor Town Cafe? Thanks, bud. Hmm. Word around town is that record is that recording the strange sparkling monster will grant you will grant you magnetic powers. Neat, huh? Hmm. All right. Bonjour. Clemence. Sweet, sweet Clemence. I need resources. Chrome tapes would do wells, would do me some good as well. Eh. 
a spray can of unisex persp pers perspirant anti-deodorant. The label says it'll make you smell strong enough to repel monsters for one minute. It's not very strong. Guarantees a successful escape from a wild monster. Won't fuel cool humans and other sentient creatures, though. It wouldn't hurt to have, I guess. I mean, I've just got plastic burning a hole in my back pocket. Okay, I've already got a fair number of tapes, so... Yes, I would love to see your support stickers. Delegate. Transfer the user's status effects onto its ally. Gasoline spray. Gives the target flammable status. Plus 11% accuracy. Yeah, I'll take one of those. That's for sure. Huh. You could use some passive moves, too. Insomnia. Prevents the user from falling asleep. Earth camouflage. Poison camouflage. Automatically used at the start of a battle for zero AP, changes the type of the user. Passively reduces incoming air type damage from 50% and negates any reactions that occur, does not affect crits. Alright, and how about you, buddy? Crystal Lens, Icicle Dark, Undertow, Bottle Volley, and Bone Cannon. Alright, well, we'll pick up Crystal Lens. And a bottle bottle. Glass type seems interesting. And incredibly unique. Was back here. lot of nothing, it looks like. Alright, what's my party looking like? Now, I think as I, I have Tokusak, and I want to keep him in the party. But... I need to make room for something else, so... Plus, I've already got two wind type or air types, so I like to try and keep my teams as diverse as possible. Uh... We'll keep Masquerade. Got Spitzfire, so I'd rather not have him in the party. Um, yeah, we'll take Wing Gloom. Uh, check the tape. Edit stickers. Yeah, because Wing Gloom's a, a fair, a slower all rounder. He's a bit more defensive. But at the same time, his attack isn't, you know, completely garbage. So... Let's take off that and... Zephyr. And let's see what we can apply. Elemental Wall, Uncommon, Bloodlust... Gasoline spray. I'd, I'd want to give gasoline spray to a fire type, if anything. Probably Belossa Rifle. Uh... Incompatible. Incompatible. Right, let's slap on an elemental wall. Use 
boost automatically at the start of the battle for zero AP. It gives the user multi-target status for three turns. Yeah, we'll give him echolocation. It's technically a passive, but... I mean, it activates as a passive, but, you know. <sighs> Poppercut's gonna upgrade... Poppercut's gonna hit level 5 soon, so that's pretty good. Or rank 5, rather, so that's good. Uh... Like, Wultergeist. Seems Wultergeist is moving toward more towards uh, a melee fighter. That's pretty good, I guess. Melee attacks going up. Defenses are both are also both pretty good. I wonder. I'm not entirely sure how training a tape works. Like. Maybe the more you use a specific type of, like, a specific kind of attack, the more a specific stat goes up. But we've got wall, so... And keep a nurse, so let's slap ritual on here as well. This can come in handy, especially during, like, a harder time. Uh... I don't see myself using Sharpen a lot, but I probably should. Uh, Decibel. Let's take a look see here. You've got a bunch of empty slots. Let's fix that. First and foremost, you don't need Provoke. You're a ranged defender, and we don't need you pissing people off. So, move that down to here. We're also going to take off Call for Help. It... It is. It does not help. Uh, apply to the sticker. Zephyr's a good like one damp single target 60, 60 power attack. Roll again. throw sprint on there too. Because Decibel is surprisingly slow. Uh, Spitsfire. Zoomies is basically quick attack. Uh, I'm gonna peel B random. Throw gasoline spray on him. Because then I can throw. Ah, oh, damn it. Because then. He can actually, you know, make use of it. Yeah, alright. Pupper cuts. You still haven't fully upgraded, or you still got, you know, an evolution. Sorry, remaster. 
don't want the poke purists coming after me. Right, Master Rattle. Gives the user multi strike for three turns. Mm. Critical on type advantage, but beast type doesn't have a type advantage. Yeah, that'll do. Uh... Hey, Dells, how you doing? Go easy on me, okay? I'm still new to this morning child cult thing and don't want to look bad in front of the others. No. I will beat you senseless now. <laughs> Just spent some time editing abilities and whatnot. Fucking cult thing proceeds to roll out a Yorman gold. Like it's nothing. Uh oh. Uh, that's good, I get. That's good to hear. I hope you're doing okay. Let me check what my book says I'm supposed to do when I can defeat it. <laughs> Greetings. I'm here to speak to Dorian. <laughs> Miss Kaylee, welcome back. Come, come, you're just in time. Alright, guess we're going in. Huh? Just in time? Just in time for what? Where is everyone? Is something happening? Let's go about the place. I ran so far away. Just, uh, okay, yep, that's up and running. Huh? What are you doing here? Why aren't you at- wait, is that you, Kaylee? You're a deserter! Yes, I did in fact beat the ever-loving piss out of an intern. And I'd do it again! Alright. Let's see what this Resonate business is all about. Chop! 
Resonance. Each time Resonance is inflicted on a character, it adds a counter. When the counter reaches three, the character is shaken apart and is instantly defeated. Oh! It's a Doom Timer! Turns the lowest of the social hierarchy. <laughs> oh, that's so mean. But also incredibly accurate. Uh. Desperation. Alright, fusion meter's uh. full. Uh, deserter. I don't even remember this man, but he seems to remember me. Come on, let's keep going. The scribbled notes say the flying saucer creature will emerge from its shell if given the ability to remain close to its opponent. Interesting. Nothing that you know driving was say wasn't you know too awful. Wait, you there! You aren't wearing your robes. Are you outsiders here to sabotage the ceremony? Hey, yo! Look at this little dude, Salamagus! I want one. It's hilarious, and I want one. Look at this googly-eyed little idiot. Pyromelian! Oh, that's brilliant! Oh, that's hilarious. I love it. So yeah, I was right about fire types interacting with air types. When fire types deal damage to an air type, it creates an air wall. Aw, <laughs> oh, nuts. for the supplies, no. dummy. You won't stop us. How about I do anyway? Do, 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 do. Just gonna throw that switch. Oh, no! Uh -oh. Are, are you an intruder? Or you will be super mad at me if I fail to stop you. I 
I cast these hands. Honestly, Thwackalo is actually kind of a spooky fight to go up against. Because a lot of my party does not do well against it. Exclusively because a lot of Thwackalopes I go up against always use charge. Not to mention, Thwackalope has the speed advantage. Status whenever they are hit by fire type attacks. In addition, the damage received from burned is increased. Gasoline spray just literally doused them in petrol. <laughs> uh. Just toss a jerry can onto them. <laughs> I better fight you anyway. Fine. Dorian was expecting some trouble from before the ceremony, so I've been keeping watch. Never more. Look at it! It's a little plague doctor crow! It's just a little plague doctor! I love it! This is a little guy! to give you such a walloping. Can Winglu evolve again? Because, I mean, look at how much energy or AP Kaylee has in comparison to Winglu. I think Winglu, Winglu can evolve a second time. I might be wrong. Alright, let's see what an electric wall looks- or a lightning wall looks like. Eh. Oh, that's brilliant. Echo look. Multi target allows me to throw up multiple walls. That is smart as heck. <laughs> wow, okay, rude. Myself. I 
car is officially defrosted. Good to hear. Hey, new friends! Unfortunately, it is the will of the Serpent God that I defend our commune from outsiders. But it's really nothing personal. Y'all be worshipping snakes? really want to get my hands on a Yorman Gold. That is an awesome looking design. I really want to shake, I want to shake the hand of whoever thought of putting, it's too fucking funny, right? Hoping there's a spot with that we can rest soon, cause oh, I need to repair my tapes. Oh, there goes Decibel. Rude. God, I've already lost almost nearly half my party. Guaranteed. To hey, Surefire. Nice. Nothing. Personal. Uh, there's still a fair few cultists. Alright, let's head back to the campsite outside and try again. Because beaten trainers don't come back. Kaylee tells you about her various ventures helping out the people of Harbortown. your day been, Dells? going to the interns and going, hey, buddy, I have a wonderful assignment for your first day on job. Security! Now make sure no one passes or there will be consequences. Bye! It is the duty of the morning of the morn children to repel outsiders! You do not wear the garb of the morn child! Therefore, you must be vanquished! Easy there, buddy. Calm down. How dare you have a siren aid in my presence! Yeah, that's that's fair. Yeah, I'd rather not spend the AP, but there we go. Whoa, it nearly knocked him out. Oh. oh my god, that's hilarious. Kit Telly is a cat with a TV for a hand. Look at it! Oh, these designs are fantastic! I love it! Ooh, right. Lightning type. Oh. 
Zedrin Colored Edition. <laughs> Oh, that's right! When, uh, when you get monsters to rank 5, they get a second bio entry. Bio 2. The Tsuchinoko in a, is a creature of Japanese folklore. Similar to a snake, it is described as having venomous fangs, uh, the venomous fangs of a viper, but, it, well, the, uh, but with a somewhat flat body. Hmm. Banshee. The eerie, uh, ghosts commonly appear in folklore all across human history and civilizations as manifest manifestations of the spirits of the deceased. Whether they are harmless or malevolent varies on the depiction or, or often the personality of the departed. Like, you see that there are three more entries below between Woltergeist and Sirenade, right? I'm starting to think that there might be more evolutions. Sirens are... Okay, so the second page is based on their, um... Their mythological... Inspiration. To give numbers, a normal day for us is usually doing around 30,000... 30,000 picks on Monday it was 13 today. Oh god. It's like you made up for what you missed and then some. You know, there's a lot of symbolic significance to the transformative power of the cassette tapes. The four sides of its rectangular shape aligns with aligns the four sides of man, front, back, left and right. Anyway, I should probably be trying to stop you right about now. Oh, look, he's a starter grade. Masquerettel! Uppercut! I'ma bite ya! Yeah, you can't meditate now that I pissed you off! <laughs> hmm, I'll have to double check Master Rattle's stats because I don't think it's a melee attacker. I might be wrong. Oh, he did! shift. Fuse user's attack can hit ghosts. Hmm. <sighs> Cassettes are interesting. Morning Town Key, Thunder Blast, and a recycled tape. A tape apparently made from 100% recycled plastic has a very high efficiency when recording plastic type monsters. <laughs> oh, I vaporized. Yeah, yeah, I did. Behind the house. <laughs> I can't believe Brother Cooper stuck me on guard duty. After all that digging I did, I'm the most devoted Mourn child! And maybe beating you will prove my worth to him. Oh, you're adorable. Well, time to die. It really is! It's like a- it's a healthy mix of a traditional RPG and Pokemon. What? 
Exactly. Devotion doesn't equal skill, my dude. Get battered, numb nuts. Unfortunate. Uh. I'm not good enough. All right, drive safe. Why, hello. Man, all the digging has been making me so hungry. I'm not gonna fight you on an empty stomach. Ugh. You know, I'm more surprised that Earth-type doesn't have an interaction with Air-type. God, that just almost immediately killed him. I'm starting to think that, uh, Woltergeist is a, he is a physical attacker. Cool drawn! Look at it! That's cool! Oh, I love it! That's a fantastic design! Yeah, I'm almost certain Voltergeist has a second evolution. Right? All I want is a sandwich. Ah! Not gonna use it on Pupper Cut because he's still pretty high health. <clears throat> May we have quiet in the audience? Who is she? She, my replacement. Creepy. <laughs> Dorian will now speak. What the fuck? Oh, no, he's a sleaze. Man. Man, what a great crowd you always are. Listen, guys, more and children or whatever. You've all been doing such a great job with the digging. I mean, really, seriously, this is some, this is a primo quality hole. <laughs> this pit is as deep as your devotion to the cause. It's like a metaphor. When I first heard the whispers in my head guiding me beneath the earth, I knew I couldn't do this alone. And sure, we've had met, we've had ups and downs, but we've done it! Pull the curtain! The serpent god awaits us, baby! That's a subway station. Soon I will enter the chamber and bargain with him for a share of his divine power. And to accompany me, our prodigal daughter returns to us. Isn't that right? Kaylee. Oh no. Oh no. Kaylee, honey. You look like a deer in the headlights. Of course, I got word you were joining us for our big party. 
didn't tell your friend here that you helped run this place alongside me. Black sorry. I'm sorry. I'll explain later. We need to put a stop to this for now. <laughs> you didn't believe in me, did you? Well, it looks like I was right all along, baby. There's a real damn Archangel right under our feet. We fought Archangels, Dorian. If you go in there, you'll get yourself killed. If you and your friend have so much experience, why not come and join in the fun? Come on, watch me ascend to godhood with my new Archangel Jacqueline. buddy. Jacqueline, the platform, if you yes. please. As you wish, sir. See ya. See you inside, Kaylee. Uh. I hate him so much. Come on, let's go stop this idiot from whatever he's thinking, whatever he thinks he's doing. And the cultists cleared out fast. <sighs> that feeling again, like radio static in my brain. Yeah. Kaylee, Kaylee's friend, you made it. I have made the tactical decision to amend the plan, huh? sir. Kaylee and friend will go ahead. And if they are instantly killed by the Archangel, then I'll go in and do my sweet talking. You're a fool and you're going to get yourself killed. <laughs> you first. Fuck you, Dorian, you piece of shit. Another Archangel. It's as painful to look at as the others. Have you heard my call? Are you here to pay tribute? Are you here to burn for me? Here goes nothing. Oh, great Archangel! I have heeded your call and traveled to your abode. For my loyalty, I only ask for s You do not take from me. Oh, you only give. I told him this would happen. Come on, Blackmore, we gotta stop this thing before it kills anyone else. Archangel Morningstar, the Serpent God. Kaylee, let's do this! Wool Bell! Blackmore and Kaylee took an adult apple and ate it. All right. Just gonna slap this on us. Don't mind. Ritual. Characters with Ritual are brought back at 25% health when defeated. Thunderblast. Just keep energizing me, pal.
scratched up. Judgment. Makes sense. You can't have rit you can't have more than one ritual on but at a time, I guess. Or at least on yourself. I mean, what would it even do? <laughs> Miss Nerd. Okay, that one hurt. That's broadcasting again. Man, am I glad that Elemental Wall completely negates judgment. I do hate that I can't stop that I can't apply accuracy down on this thing. One more battering ram should do it. Hopefully. <laughs> Fuck. Ah, <laughs> oh, just barely. Energy shot. Use material, upgrade, and a bunch of materials. You can now glide for four seconds. If you wish to leave this land, then heed my words and hear my song. You must rise to the task at hand. You must walk the path most long. To the east, your wings must fly to the place that only I have known. For that is where my chambers lie, halls now empty and alone. The rest of the song is too quiet to make out. Morning Star, is that right? Boy, do I have a job opportunity for you! Some humans got in here. Run along now, will you? Dorian! 
is a stain on the ground. Sorry. I'm sorry, but it's his own fault. We should all get out of here. You're gonna taste like death. <sighs> the commune will open its gates. We will try to f and we will try and find common ground with the rest of New World. We only wanted guidance. We never. <sighs> I know. The people of this community aren't bad. You just have to be wary of those you put your faith into. That was messed up. Are you okay? I'm... I'll be fine. I feel awful for helping Dorian for so long, but I blame him more than I blame myself. I found the Morn children around the same time he did. I needed that sense of community and belonging. He and I became good friends, and I was something of an assistant to him. I don't know if things just slowly changed, or if things were never good, but Dorian's hold over the people of Morningtown became something sinister. It became about him, his wants, his dreams and delusions. It was no longer the community I desperately wished it was. People were hurt, and I helped smooth things over for him. No, I wasn't his assistant. I was his fixer. I felt for so long like I was doing good, hoping to maintain a positive status quo, even if people would get hurt now and then. I'm not a good person, Blackmore. Yes, you are. <laughs> I'm glad you believe that. I hope they all do better with him gone now. Lost people look for guidance, and that's what Dorian offered them. Well, we're another Archangel down, and I'm gonna help you find the rest. Fusions you form with Kaylee now have 10% added strength. Hmm. Another Archangel battle that ended with the appearance from the Triangle Man. I'm picking up a pattern here. Anyway, you said the song you hear in your head is getting longer? What was the next... What is the next line in it? But that is where my chambers lie. Hall's now empty and alone. And that's still too vague to help us out. We'll need, a, we'll need to find another Archangel. Right, let's crack on! Where are we off to next? Can we hear something about... Some rumors about something happening in Eastham Woods? We could see what's happening there if you want. It sounds like a plan to me. But we gotta, you know... Work with Captain Zed first. What's on the menu? I'll take another chrome tape. Uh, let's round that out to 20. Au revoir. Hmm. I heard Captain Penny Dreadful can often be found in the in the ruined village east of here. Hmm. Penny Dreadful. I feel like that's a pun. All right. I have a theory. I hope I'm right. <gasps> I'm right! Oh, what do you remaster into? Woltergeist has become... Ramtasm! The Ramtasm has its horned... has honed its connection between the physic, spiritual and physical realms, and is able to fully manifest itself across both simultaneously. This gives it access to untapped... to an untapped well of tremendous astral energy. Oh my god, it's amazing! I love it! I love it! It looks so good! Alright, let's take a look at its stats, though. Check tape. Oh, that is a melee fighter if I ever saw one. 
All right. Uh, I like Wallop, but we're gonna replace it. Where is that phase shift? The ability to hit ghosts is gonna be real useful. Ramtasm looks so good. Oh my god. It is said that there are many types of ghosts. One such example is the poltergeist. The poltergeist is, the polster ah, the poltergeist is unique in its ability to interact extensively with the physical world and is able to move and propel objects as it wishes. Oh my god, look at it! It's so good! Ramtasm looks amazing. Oh my goodness. Get zapped, idiot! Alright, how many am I? You wanted me to take out five, right? Take a three. This will be a four.
Ugh. Ugh, gotta stay hydrated. Wackalope already has, like, absurdly high base speed. Just the zoomies and not charge. Scattershot. Come Thanks. On. Thanks for that, man. Thanks for that. Man, it shouldn't be this hard for a ranger captain to get a bit of shut eye around here. Oh. Oh, totally forgot you were a ranger captain. Uh... Uh, I guess you're gonna take my ranger training challenge, right? Bring it! <sighs> Alright, uh, Let's hit the hay. I, I mean, hit the battlefield. Yeah, that. Meditator. Okay. Can't intercept multi target. Right, Astral Type. It's gonna get buffed by Kaylee. Characters with locked on can't miss. Locked on anymore. And if I hit you with Salamagus, and if I hit Salamagus, it won't be able to uh, apply lock on. Which keeps you from being able to instantly hit. Which will keep you from being able to immediately lock on to me and just wreck my shit. Yeah, because all of that, because all of, um, why can't I remember its name? Starter Grade, right. Because of all, all of Starter Grade's abilities are, well, like, all of its power comes from when it's asleep, specifically through Sleep Talk, Sleep Walk, and Tulpa. All of which have an absurdly low chance of working because you're asleep. It's like a 10% chance. It's actual hot garbage.
Double snap. Right, while well, Tardigrade... Er, well, Stardigrade's asleep, it restores health. I think that's one of its passive abilities. Fight guy? Have I won yet? Oh. Oh. What is that? I don't know what it is, but it looks cool as hell. That's pretty nasty. Uh, don't have a whole lot of power left for a fusion. Or not enough for a fusion, rather. got Zed stuck in a loop because he can't attack because astral types have a grave weakness being hit by impure elements. Okay, so the highest the stack can go is 16. Got it. I'm tired. Bro, I feel that. Sharp Edges gives the user a contact damage status for three turns. Nice. Wow. Wow. I think that final blow woke me up a bit. Here's your reward. Meditate. Uncommon. Puts the user to sleep. Puts the user to sleep. Increases the user's attack and defense stat every turn it's asleep. All of up. Instantly levels up one character. A strange olive flavored soft drink. Mm. Gross. You could do with a cup of coffee to wake me up. Yeah, that just sounds horrible. That just sounds awful. An olive flavored soft drink. Blech. I'm gonna be honest, Diantha. I don't think the other captains get it. Uh -huh. Get what exactly? The whole sleep thing, man. My whole deal. They don't know about the dreamscape, the collective subconscious, or how any of it affects this whole space. If I'm honest, I'm starting to suspect they think I'm just a big slacker. Well, well, you are a big slacker. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Don't worry about the others. They don't have to understand your work. They just have to respect my decision to make you a captain. Thanks. Thanks for the pep talk, Captain. Oh, <sighs> this human interaction really takes it out of a guy. I think I'm gonna go get some shut eye. Hello. What have you got? A Bulletino cartridge shirt. Having one of these in your pocket will upgrade your Bulletino dash but the ability to inflict damage at the start of a battle if it was used in battle before if it was used if it wasn't used before the battle started useful 
mini fridge. I can sew this into your backpack. To... <laughs> How small is this fridge? <laughs> Got some... Hmm. There's news? When I saw a tiny little domino off in the clearing in the center of Cher Cherry Meadow, it wasn't a... it wasn't just a baby, it was small enough to fit in my hand. I think it got like that. Something strange is going on over there. Hmm. Well, we'll have to look into that. Hmm. How are we doing, stickers? Sticker vendors? Stab in the dark? Wow! 10% chance. Yikes. Metal Riff hits a whole team. Becomes an Air Titan attack when equipped to a Metal Titan tape. Sandstorm reduces remaining status effect durations by one. Hits each member of, the, of a team multiple times. Chance to hurt an opponent automatically based upon melee, uh, upon melee contact. Damage is based on the user's melee defense. AP starter, chance one additional AP at the start of the battle, cold fusion, fossil. Automatically restores the user's health to full if they become petrified. Metal resistance. Beast camouflage. That could actually come in handy. Because from my experience, beast type has no interactions. Yeah, and I'll take metal resistance too, why not? Hey. Avalanche. All melee attacks fail this round. Beast wall, sacrifice 20%. Iron feelings. Makes the target conductive. I'll pick up one of those. Tells you a funny anecdote about her life. Remaster your pupper cut tape, pupper cut tape into a more powerful form. Pupper cut became Southpaw. Southpaws are the final stage of a pupper cup's pupper cut's life cycle, having shed their rusty armor. Their bodies are now coated in a lightweight and flexible metal that allows them to withstand attacks and deliver swift blows with their spike fists. Sweet. Let's take a look at you, huh? Oh wow, that's actually really good. It's a it's a good strong melee melee uh, fighter. Melee attack one sixty, melee defense one forty, speed one fifty. What's up, Dels? stickers can we get up? Deja vu, desperation, wallop. Honestly, yeah, uh, do I still have... No, I don't. Okay, so I will apply Deja Vu.
Dad is messed up by sickness or alcohol. Dinner isn't started and I started now and we'll eat super late and all the groceries. Oh, jeez. That's rough, man. That's real rough. Oh, by the way, while you were gone, Woltergeist has, a, has another remaster. Say hi to Ramtasm. I know, the name is great. The name is fantastic. Alright, uh, we got Southpaw. I'm gonna put him in storage. Uh, same with Spitzfire. And let's take a look at some tapes that need upgrades, that need love. You know what? Let's get Squirey in here. We need the boy. I hate that I don't have a water type. And Blossom is more of a tank. Alright, take care. And we'll take we'll we'll take Blossom on too. Managed to find that wood. <laughs> you. Hey, thanks for your help. I was dreading the thought of collecting all those materials myself. Yeah, since you helped me out, why don't you decide on on the design? The sign should feature an emblem that really sums up the harbor town. What do you think? A dolphin. I mean, we're on the water. All right, let's go with that. Even if dolphins are pure fucking evil. Oh. Woo! All done. What do you think? Looks Brilliant. great. <laughs> Lived my whole life here, but a lot of folks come from different places and get stuck here. This makes them feel even a little bit better when they see it. Then it was worth the effort, I think. Hmm. Hypnotize, copper chop, and upgrade. Really should do my side quests. <sighs> On the hunt. I mean, I'm probably going to head that way anyway, because Captain Penny Dreadful's over there. But let's check out the rest of Harbor Town. We haven't given it a proper once-over. Well, it's just going to be a bad surprise for her. I'll offer to go out and get some. Okay. Do you recycle items you don't need anymore? Not only is it a good way to declutter your inventory, it also gives back some of the resources that went into making the item. You can trade those resources for something else. Here, give it a go with this old book. I don't need it anymore. Wow, for... it's a fair chunk of pulp. Holding on to any old tapes and storage that you don't need anymore? Next time you're taking a break from your travels, why not recycle one? At a campsite or in the cafe, open up your tape storage, select the tape you don't want, then hit recycle. It's a good way to get back, get some extra resources that you can trade for merch, trade with merchants, and make you some stick, extra stickers from that monster's pool. Fair enough. I'd rather not recycle a monster, though. Your recent arrival. I've been here 20 years. Eventually, the novelty and strangeness of it all will just be a part of everyday life. Why, I barely even think about the fact that I live on an island populated by giant monsters. <sighs> Captain Buffy's my favorite. She works out in Cheery Meadow, you know? Buffy. <laughs> I wonder if her playstyle revolves around buffing. Hmm. There's no time to check. There's no time to chat. I have an order of pastries to finish preparing. Hmm. We usually cook food for the townsfolk here, but we haven't received ingredients from the far from the farm west of here for a while. I wonder what's going on. Oh, 
Oh, it's spooky in here. Hello. Welcome. Welcome, inquiring souls. Are you here to learn about the astral arts? Sure. Excellent. You would be wise to heed my words. You see, beasts of the astral type draw their power from the four basic elements of nature. Earth, water, fire, and air. An astral creature exposed to any of these four elements will be empowered. <laughs> However, their internal heart... Yeah, I know this. Okay, cool. Thanks. Kind of already knew that. Wow, yeah. hmm. It's enough food to go around in Harbor Town, but options are limited. I haven't had a duck roll in forever. I'd love to say that I make all the clothes in Harbor Town, but for a while now, the Rangers have been delivering clothes to us from the abandoned mall in the north. I just clean it and repair them. There's a mall? <sighs> I was hoping to cross the bridge, but it's been raised for a while now. That's fine. I can stay on this side of town, I guess. You're new to the whole cassette tape transforming thing, huh? A little piece of advice for you. The key is to not think about how it works. By all accounts, it doesn't make sense. But it does work, so just go along with it. I mean, yeah, that's... fair. Well, let's make our way over to Captain Penny Dreadful. There's no there's no reason to fight this traffic crab. It's only level one. Really? Ramtasm can't use it? Huh. Weird. Excuse me. Oh, road fusion. Better take that out. Squire Viper. don't have anything that's super effective against poison. takes care of the carnivite. Stab hit so hard. Get 
guess what, nerds? I got air- I got multi-target. So long, Carnaviper. Get out of here! Parry stance reflects the first melee attack received this round. Another ritual sticker. Alright. The Deadlands. Oh uh, yeah, Nevermore. I gotta catch. I gotta record one of you guys. Yeah, I probably should be pretty careful. I don't want to instantly kill it. Good thing I have a snake skin tape. Recording. It must be noted that the Nevermort does not appear to have a beak. Rather, it is wearing what appears to be a porcelain plate doctor mask. What lies beneath the mask is something best le better left undiscovered. Ugh. Wow. Stat distribution is kind of interesting. A lot of health, a lot of speed, but its defense and attack is kind of crap. Nice! Who doesn't like a good burger? And boop. Ah, I see. Characters with parry stance reflect damage from the next melee attack they receive back onto the attack. Oh, damn it. Uh... I've been stuck here since 2160. Oi! Nobody here seems to know about the three seashells. Oh, for... Really? A total recall joke? Ugh. Oh, well, you seem interesting. Whoever you are. I must find you. Person. campsite. Yes, I will in fact camp here. Had I known there was a campsite, I wouldn't have used my fucking respools. So, I've been having been a think, bit of a think lately. Spent some time processing my feelings over my time in Morning Town. Yeah? So much of my time was spent trying to keep people happy. In fact, I spent a lot of time trying to please people. I think maybe I still do? That's all well and good, but... 
maybe it's good for me to think of what I like to do as well. Otherwise, I'll just burn myself out. Exactly! You can't live for everyone else. There'll be nothing left of me. Well, what hobbies would you like to take up? Huh? I will have to think about that. I feel like when I was younger, I used to have so much more passion for things I do as an than I do as an adult. Is that normal? I have no idea. No, no, yeah, it's it's normal. A part of a part of growing up, a lot of us lose a part of ourselves when we grow up. Like that kind of childlike innocence, wonder, and enjoyment of the world just dies. You know, I used to play guitar. Same as my dad. Earliest memories of me sitting on his lap, listening to him play. How did he fit both you and a guitar in his lap at the same time? Very carefully. I bought my own guitar in my teens, but was never particularly good at it. Guess I gave up, because I guess I felt like any hobby I had should probably amount to something eventually. Well, if I wasn't destined to become a professional musician, what was the point in doing it at all? That's not the right attitude. You know what? You're right. It is a shame that I gave up. I should do more me stuff. And I don't even have to do productive stuff. Maybe if I want to sit in bed all day and read awful romance novels, I should do that too. That's the spirit. <laughs> That's a million black one. It's good to get this off my chest. After all, we've been using we've been fusing into a great big monster together, haven't we? That's something of that's something of a bonding experience, if anything. I'm pretty I'm pretty much finished up finished with my cup of tea. What do you say? Shall we get back to it then? Social link go! 15% added strength. Nice. Plastic knife. It's one target multiple times. Yeah. Interesting. Preemptive strike, uncommon, automatically hits an opponent at the start of a battle. Oh, 10% damage, and it's a melee? Can I put that on Ramtasm? Oh, I can't. Nuts. Alright, what are you doing? Sands the time and never warned me. Oh, that's not good. Well, here's hoping he gets better, because, you know, no one likes being sick. Oh, I should have recorded that thing. The sands of time. Fog reduces accuracy of ranged attacks that are water, air, or ice type to zero for three turns. Woo! That's really good. These are the ruins of New London. New London, huh? Meditate. Stop! I know why you're here. This land is perfect or a perfect urban development opportunity. But I found it first! 
Ah, a lamp keeper. Kill it! You know, I still haven't found a pawn dead. Like an actual pawn dead. Get parried, idiot. Snooping. Opportunities for me, I'm sure. All right, let's swap some tapes around. There. You must be Captain Penny Dreadful. Hmm. Yep. They called this place New London once. Harbor Town had a lot of residents and was ready to establish a shiny new settlement. I grew up here, you know. Spent my whole childhood here, hearing stories of the real London town. Sounds like a horrible place. Cutthroats, highwaymen, vampires. I was bloody fascinating. I don't think those were all true stories. Of course, when the town burned down, all those stories were lost. Everyone and everything here went up in flames too, except little old me. Dreadful. Ranger Captain, cheater of death here in the flesh. Cheater of death? The Blighters in Harbor Town have a lot of different beliefs, but all agree in one thing. We're all gonna kick the bucket eventually. Well. I think they simply lack imagination. Death isn't the end. Not if you know the esoteric ways. I could give you a demonstration if you think you're ready for it. You're the latest Ranger trainee, right? You're looking for a, sc for a scrap to prove your worth? Bring it on! If you expect me to go soft on you because I'm a ranger captain, you're in for a proper fright. Penny Dreadful, on, Death Cheater. Ghostly. Ghostly characters can't be hit by attacks, but are defeated when the timer on Ghostly on the Ghostly status runs out. Oh, literally cheating death. Well, guess who has phase shift, baby? It's me. Get shifted, idiot. how that so that's how you're working huh well I guess I'll just have to get rid of your sands of time <laughs> you can't keep extending ghostly if your backup can't keep hitting you with dog years! And you know what? Let's see what these two look like fused. Rambo! Enough of this! You need slap it down! What is that? It's astral type, so... I mean, I've still got a wall, so... 
I'm in the clear. Ooh, it is durable. Once again, haunting itself. Hits a whole team with the user multi target stakes. Ah, ritual. Keep it. You're literally cheating death by bringing yourself back. Gotcha. I may have to take wool again off of Kaylee. Can't life absorb through a wall! <laughs> Resurrected characters can no longer be brought back by the effects of ritual. Gotcha. So ritual's a once per fight thing. Makes sense. Let's see how this whirlwind meteor. All right then. Looks like you couldn't cheat death this time, eh, Captain? Hey, Captain Dreadful. <laughs> I'm bloody impressed. Even shifting myself from this mortal plane wasn't enough to stop you from coming out on top. Use your reward for defeating the immortal Penny Dreadful. Bow, bow, bow. Ritual. Uncommon. Hey! And all of up and fuse material. Remember, trainee, if life is what you make of it, then death is too. Not quite sure what that means, but it feels profound. I mean, it sounds profound. Button. Whoops. <laughs> Ooh, those are some chunky Nevermorts. Definitely. Uh, hold on, I have a small bomb. I'll just use that. I'd rather not have this fight. Uh, I... That needs a power I don't have. Ooh, rock. Ha! Ah, another rock. There we go. Oh, I love having such a big brain. Revolving door steals the target's wall and transfers it to the user. Plastic, wood, pulp. A wheat and ethereal tape. Awesome. Well, I guess that covers everything here. Back to Harbor Town! Yeah, I should probably switch out you switch out for Eugene soon, huh? Wouldn't hurt. We do need to go through the landkeeper bases. You've been to the ham before? You know, that little valley west of Eastham Woods where Captain Lodestein hangs out? I have not, but uh, good to know that's where Captain Lodestein is. Well... I've been told that there's a monster wearing diving gear that grants you the ability to swim in any waters if you record it. Hmm, useful. I'll have to find it. Greetings! Greetings, my eager assistant! Have you recorded our mystery monster? We're looking for a crow with a hood and mask spotted in the Deadlands. Excellent! Yep, Nevermort. Excellent. Once again, you prove to be a capable researcher. Nevermort, is it? Alas, we have but one monster left on my list of pressing investigations. Iyantha herself has spoken of a creature that flees if it catches even a glimpse of a human being. It's supposedly a wooden-faced elf in the park. This sounds like something you would- you will be able to record. I wish you good fortune. Alright. A wooden-faced elf. Mm. 
Mantis! Oh, good! Oh, thank God. Partner characters level up. Level up on their own. I want a double Big Mac with a poutine. <laughs> Oh, that's good. I was worried that I'd have to, um, level him up myself, but I don't, so that helps. All right, there's a landkeeper office over in Autumn Hills, so. Hey, how dare you follow me? That's rude. I'd rather not. Thanks. What up, landkeepers? Excuse us for dropping in. Such short-sightedness you young people possess. Can't you appreciate the investment opportunities we could open up for you? Couple of spring heels. and snooping. Again, both beast type. Alright, as much as I like Cloxley, he's pretty weak at the moment. So let's switch you out for... What are you doing, my man? <laughs> uh, then again, in my defense, I am like, I am All near right. 10 levels over these things. All right, nice work. Maybe these parasites will start to realize who they're messing with. I mean, yeah, they're landowners, but... Is Parasite really... They're estate agents, sure, but is Parasite really necessary, Eugene? It's, it seems a bit harsh. I don't know. Yeah, I'll save that upgrade. No money, no problem. We're off offering fine. Okay, never mind. Ten thousand percent per annum. Nah, put them in the dirt. Ten thousand percent a year. Fuck that. Exist in my presence. Stop it. Mm. 
New World doesn't have a currency, so there's no way to pay it off yet. Interest continues to compound in the meantime, however. It's a perfect scheme. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. A scheme. And y'all are monsters. Good God. 10,000%. I don't care what reality you're from. There's no way that's legal. All right, enjoy your food. Target! I have found you! Recording! Oh, that's really low. That upped it a fair bit, but... Let's try this again with, an, with a chrome tape. Man, it's amazing how quickly basic tapes just stop being useful. Gotcha. hide their true emotions, Elfless fashions crude smiling mass out of tree bark. Unsubstantiated rumors claim that there is one day a year where all Elfless will assemble together to replace their new old masks with new ones. Wow, that is very all around. A hundreds across the board. I would like to catch a tariff of them. Don't have any dirt tape, earth type tapes, so I guess we'll just use a crawl. Recording! Stay with me, Eugene. Oh my god. All right. Terra cookers are aspiring chefs and will attempt to cook with whatever ingredients they, they can find in their subterranean cave habitats. Unfortunately, this mostly means that their practice recipes include lichen, moss, or both lichen and moss. Gross. Brick Blast! Oh, I didn't 
want to cap Elemental Wall. That's some shenanigans. I meant to cast Battering Ram. Oh well, whatever. Knocked his ass clean out. Whoa! Terror Ray! don't know if grass type has an in if plant has an interaction with earth i mean you'd think it would Plant-type attacks carry seeds with them that are implanted in Earth-type targets to drain energy. Well, look at that! So whenever a plant-type enemy, uh, whenever a plant-type attack lands on an Earth-type enemy, it will always apply the Leech status. Based. Alright, so Slice is a group-wide metal-type attack. That's good. Or probably just typeless. I'll have to double-check. Rattles at level sit at level five or rank five. It can rank up. A faux fur tape, a tape covered in faux fur material, has a high efficiency rate when used to record beast type monsters. Popular with kids. AP refund, chance to automatically refund AP after a move is used. Ooh, that's good. I might throw that on Ram... on Ramtasm. I'm telling you, boss, something shifted on the astral plane lately. All the ghosts are talking about it. There's some big players back on the board, they're saying. Uh -huh. All the ghosts? Yeah. Of course. There's all sorts of spirit shades and tulpas hanging out in the astral plane. Where do you think I get my best intel from? Uh -huh. I'll take your word for it. Greetings. What up? 
Greetings, my eager assistant. Have you recorded our mystery monster? We're looking for a wooden-faced elf spotted in the park. Oh. Here it is. The elfless eye. What could the significance of this be? Perhaps there's some deep psychic connection between how human beings perceive faces and how these monsters manifest into being? It could also simply be that masks look rather cool. I must congratulate you on your abilities. Why, at this rate, I feel like I am the assistant and you are the scientist. The truth is... The truth is, I'm not actually a professor or a scientist. Before I washed ashore on New World, I was a corporate salary man. I am less a patron of science and more a patron of science fiction. Even still, I must remain rational. Coming here was has given my life a new purpose. I may not be a real professor, but I believe my efforts here can still be Thank valuable. You. Thank you for your unrelenting assistance in this scientific cause, my friend. You set an example for us all. Hmm. If you ever want my help cataloging further, come chat with me again. There will always be something new to investigate. Greetings! Goodness gracious! 29! Thank you for your work. Here's some compensation for your time. Ooh. Ah, a ceramic tape. A tape with a hardened ceramic shell has a high efficiency rate when used to record Earth-type monsters. Nice. Elements sticker pack. Eh, I'd rather not burn my metal just yet. We'll take a quick rest. Hmm. I need to go back to my workout routine soon. Can't save the world if I'm not at the top of my game, you know. Maybe one day some dumbbells will wash up on the beach. Alright, Master Rattle. Which aspect of the serpent do you embody? Elegance or ruthlessness? Let's see what ruthlessness gives us. Yes, Jormund Gold. Let's go. Curiously, the Jormund Gold's wings aren't actually capable of making this huge serpent airborne. Instead, they help it slither along the ground at great speeds, each wing beat sending the beast hurtling forward. Awesome. to put in its place, what to put in its place. You know, it wouldn't hurt to have a to have elfless, I guess. You still gotta work on maxing out Squirey, and Wingloom probably can still improve further. Unicast gives the target Unitarget the Unitarget status for three turns. Plus one duration. Useful! Welcome. Now I'm looking for supplies. Oh, you're... Oh! Removes type trading Kojin status from one party member. Uses up a turn during combat. Doesn't use up your turn. Nice! Promise to try. Alright, quest log.
May as well look for Meredith. What? Is this a train station? No one ever said something like this was on, on New World. Oh yeah, that's right. You haven't seen these. They're pretty big mushrooms, buddy. Wink lowers the target's melee attack and an ethereal take. Right. Someone to beat to prove our worth to the Rangers. Um. Sure. Do your best, buddy! Get a random buff. No. Who am I kidding? I'm not good enough for the Rangers. Hey now, don't sell yourself short. You did your best. I just did better. Oh, the new boy. You knew about me. Hoylake was babbling on about you when you came, when he came by to pick up some parts for my shop. Have you met him? He's the worst. Huh. Did you know he's not even a real scientist? Before he landed on New World, he was a data analyst. Someone needs to tell him that wearing a t-shirt that says I love science is not a personality. I'm Meredith. Anyway, I'm Meredith. Enjoy being trapped on this rock forever with the rest of us until you die. It doesn't seem so bad. There's like, what, a couple hundred people here, Max? You run out of things to talk about pretty quick. Trust me. Anyway, I just needed a brief breath of fresh air. Come meet me at my shop in town sometime. Yellow building on the boardwalk. Alright. Real ray of sunshine, that one. Oh, you again. I had something to ask you. You really gonna be searching for a way off this island? Huh. Yeah! Huh. I almost admire your optimism. Well, if you're gonna be doing the whole travel across the land thing, could you look out for something for me? Sure, what are you looking for? Uh... It's a, um, music record. Do you know what that is? Yeah! Okay. Okay, cool. It's, uh, hard to know who knows what around here. Not everyone comes from similar worlds. Makes it pretty hard to talk to people. Harder than usual, even. Anyway, the record. It's an album. All I Ever Needed by The Witch House. Maybe you've heard of it? I used to listen to it back in my previous life. It has sentimental value, okay? There's a few music nerds in Harbor Town. Record you can ask them for me? Sure. Don't know anything. Oh. 
Bonjour. Uh, have you ever heard of All I Ever Needed by the Witch ah. House? Do I have this record? No. No, uh, you could ask the rangers at Town Hall. Alright. Au revoir! Hey. Something on your mind? Yeah, I'm looking for a, a music record. All I Ever Needed by the Witch House. Meredith is looking for a music record. You must know your chances of finding this particular record are pretty close to zero, right? Can't really emphasize that enough. The things that end up in New World come from a lot of different worlds, you know. Nonetheless, you might have some luck in the f in Fall Down Mall. Fall Down Mall? Oh, of course you do. It's a shopping complex on the north side of New World. Totally abandoned. Just popped into being after about 15 years ago. It's where we get all the clothes for the locals, not to mention our cassette players and tapes. It's a music shop in the mall, filled with records and cassette tapes, but we keep it locked up for security. Cassette supplies are pretty important, after all. It's a good idea to keep them safe. If the record is there, Meredith might be risking her life just to get it. The rational part of me wants to formally forbid her from trying, but if you go with her, maybe that's a little safer. Here, take this. An envelope for Meredith. this? A letter? Oh. Uh... It's a note from Ayantha. For my aunt. She says my record might be at Fall Down Mall and I have permission to go, but only if you accompany me. She also included the keys to get in. <laughs> well, shall we go then? You serious? Don't worry, I can defend myself. You don't think I wouldn't have my own cassette player, <sighs> Sitting around here all day is killing me. Finding that album is just something to strive for, I guess. It's like, if you don't have something to keep you going, you may as well be dead, right? Do you? Do you know what's driving you nowadays? I want to find a way back home. Like I said to you before, that's impossible, but... If you help me find my record, I'll help you find your way home. <laughs> Why not, right? I'll need something to new to strive for, after all. Kitelli! The Kitelli's only way to communicate is through the static pattern on its television-like face. These messages are often, often difficult to decipher, and it this often this often prevents the common Kitelli from being able to connect with other creatures. Aw, poor fag. Smack, criticize, charge. Looks like we're heading north! After a quick break, I'm going to use the restroom, stretch my legs, all that good stuff. We'll be back in a few minutes.
Okay, sorry about the delay. Ugh, I was gone for a few minutes. Okay. Really had to get stuck in a town this dull, you know? That's not so bad. Beachfront property. Sure, there's only a couple hundred people on the island, but that really such a bad thing? Chemical imbalance. Chance to automatically use the next move in the list for zero AP when the user lands a type advantaged hit. This chance is reduced in proportion to the move's normal AP cost. Hmm. Wasn't there a quest for like a... Okay, yeah, it's up north. It's further north. Well, there's apparently a train station around here. Oh, wait, that's the... That's the one from earlier. <laughs> that's the first one we went to. Never mind. I'm stupid! Yeah! This isn't where we need to go. Why is this lava? Ah, that's why. Road fusion. Guess we'll take it out. Salad room. One sharpen and a battering ram, I've got a half HP. Like, good god, that is ridiculous. Oh, you no- Oh, you want a beat down, huh? Excuse me? That did 192 damage. What the fuck?
All right, that shook it up pretty bad. Hopefully that'll put it, give us enough. Yep, 100. Just need Meredith to survive. Oh, thank God. Cool. Hell yeah, Salamagus. The slippery Salamagus is a student of pyromancy and other arcane arts. It is able to breathe fire using fuel it's using the fuel it stores in the pouches on its head. Incidentally, these look like giant googly eyes to the untrained eye. Those aren't its eyes! Those are fire pouches! That's brilliant! Ice and water conduct electricity, leaving them weak to future lightning type attacks. That's a problem. Why do I keep missing? What the? Missing. Snow Rush, uncommon. Four damage per empty, four percent damage per empty slot, and four percent priority chance for double smack. Nice. And we even picked up the slight, and we even picked up the funny, spicy lizard. That's how you open that one? Oh, I'll come back for that later. up there? I've seen them all over the island. They emit, emit a constant magnetic pull. Maybe there's a monster right that has magnetic abilities we could use. We should take a look around. Well, the incest. I'd more like to find a campsite, if anything. But... Rack suit and bolt ham. Uh, you know, I should have used an aerosol tape. Uh, what's up? Oh, yeah, the link is... The link should be good. Ah. 
Shoot up. <laughs> That's hilarious. Cool. Rack suit. Rack suits put a lot of attention into their appearance. They seem to become very distressed if their collars and ties become lopsided or disheveled. Uh, I will say this, though. Any money that's donated is going to be put into a hold because of how PayPal works and because I rarely receive donations on it. It's, it's, is whatever. It's dumb. Recording! Ugh, 17%. Stay with me, Meredith. Oh, that was rough. Hey, we got it. On a 14%. It's not going to be frozen. I'm just not going to have access to it for, like... I want to say 14 business days. The metal heads of the Boltams are extremely conductive, and they passively absorb electric currents from the atmosphere. Boltams are able to channel this energy into a magnetic field, which they can use to travel across the land and air with ease. Oh, they're very fast. What is that smack? Wow. Plus 15% damage, plus 9% damage per empty slot, plus 5% accuracy. I, I don't know why. Bash bosh. It's a whole team. Mind meld. Frame rate dipped for a minute there. Just gonna rest real quick. Meredith eagerly recounts the plot of a fantasy novel she adores. Oh, fun! Oh, what you turn into? Mothmanic. The Mothmanic's whole body surges with powerful currents of electricity. It can wield this power offensively and is able to dispense devastating bolts of lightning towards its targets with a beat of its wings. Oh my god. Oh my god, how did I not see this? Tokusect evolves during the... You get Tokusect by evolving a Dominoth during the day. You get Wing Gloom, and then eventually Moth Manic when you evolve a Dominoth at night. They are both Toku references, specifically to Common Rider Black! Moth Manic is Shadow Moon! How did I miss that? Oh my god, that's brilliant. Tape storage. We caught a Salamagus, by the way. Oh, I, I, what I need to do is set up another 
I need to set up another watch party is what I need to do. Because I have the, uh... The... Kamen Rider Black miniseries that was released on Netflix... Or not Netflix, Amazon Prime a while ago. And honestly, that's a fantastic series. I never finished it. I need to. Do I have a fire type in the party? No. So, yeah, I will take... We got Jormund Gold, by the way. <laughs> Honestly? You know what? I'm gonna take Traffic Crap. Phase 2 Heisei is a lot of fun. It really starts to double down into the Toyetic stuff, though, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. There we go. Oh, I'm so good at video games. Critical mass. Chance to use the next move in the list for zero AP when this u when the user lands a critical hit. Tree bark tape. A tape with a shell made of actual tree bark. High efficiency against plant plant types. All right, that's pretty useful. Oh my God, that's not a bush. Bush eye. Huh. It's kind of cute. Rebark tape. Recording. He's just a little bush. He's a little guy. Cool. He's a little guy in the bush. Bush eyes are almost exclusively found hiding within bushes, which gives them the ability to both hide from predators and sneak up on prey. They can lie motionless in hiding for hours at a time, sometimes dozing off and missing the moment to bounce on their targets. Who goes by the name Joker and he's a common writer in joy- Yes! King shit. King shit. That's good stuff. Same. 
Yeah, x a bit polarizing for some because it's a, a massive design shift. It's not enough to have a good tape. The main thing is... The main thing is to use it well. Descartes. Alright. Well, Mr. Descartes, uh, how do you feel about getting hit with some plastic? Hibernate, I hit you with an import impure element. That's supposed to piss you off. Oh my god. Gin and tonic. Gin and tonic. It's a genie that's coming out of a fucking shaker. <laughs> I love it! I was driving my little brother from... Back from school, I was using YouTube to listen to a common writer double track. Oh. oh he doesn't know any better. He doesn't know any better. The child doesn't know any better. Calm down, Blackmore. The child doesn't know any better. an insulator, and as such, glass-type attacks, attacks can limit the scope of lightning-type attackers. Gross! Also hilarious. Like, I get that it's the only form of association he had. He is a child. He doesn't know any better. Oh, that hurts me, though. Speaking of Power Rangers, the franchise is effectively dead. Well... Wanna know where your cassette tapes come from? You'll have to beat me first! Oh yeah, no, nah, uh, Hasbro is... Hun Torch. So... The most recent season of Power Rangers... The one that I've been bitching about on the Discord for months on end, Cosmic Fury, was the quote-unquote last season of Power Rangers that Hasbro was going to work on, and because they haven't sold the rights to any other company, like the, the TV rights or film rights, 
Yeah. It angers me. It angers me greatly. <laughs> Dock Leaf. Characters with Healing Leaf regain some health at the start of every turn. Well then, I guess I'm just gonna have to kill you before you can use it. <laughs> you and me both, man. You and me both. Like, <laughs> sick of Hasbro shit. <sighs> They mishandle every IP they're given, man. Hmm. Just popped into existence a few years back. Rangers have been raiding it for supplies since then, so you won't find many left in there. I heard it's haunted, though. What do you think? Take a quick rest. Recounts, eagerly recounts the plot of a fantasy novel she knows. The plot. Tripping over my own words again. Like, and the worst, the honest to God, worst part about uh, Hasbro using the... or doing what they did with the Power Rangers license is that when people criticized Cosmic Fury for huh. everything... It... They had defenders come out of their way, come out of the woodwork and say, Oh, you're just a Sentai purist. You, Sentai's restrictive. No the fuck it ain't. Ugh. Yeah, no, I agree. It, you can enjoy things without being a part of the community. And honestly, fandom fandom culture is by far the worst fucking thing that's ever happened. F like, fandom subculture is the worst part of the internet cult is one of the worst parts of internet culture. It's genuinely awful. If I'm being honest, I bet this place looked way tackier before all the structural decay. I admire the post-apocalypse chic. The shop that up there looks like they're... Yeah, the shop up there looks like the kind of place you'd find music, right? Let's find a way to reach it. Oh, those are ghosts. Those are actual ghosts. What the fuck? Bin Vader. Yeah, I can, I can understand that. Oh, God. Right, I'm the only one in this party who can actually do damage to these things. Ramtasm's the only one who can do damage because of his... Recording! Because of Plane Shift. Sixty-three percent. That's pretty low, but we should be able to do it. Eh, Thirty-eight. Yeah. Run it back. That should shoot at the percentage. Right up! Yes! Do it! Cool! Bin Vader. Bin Vaders appear to be tentacled green beings housed inside a compact vehicle that is reminiscent of a garbage can. It has two arms on its front, 
One for emitting deadly beam attacks, and the other for aggressive wicker. It's a goddamn Dalek. That is a Dalek! It's a garbage can! It is an alien- Like, not just design- Not just, like, what it says in its- In its bestiary log. It is literally a bargain bin Dalek. Look at it! Look at the little arms! The little arms, the... Pro... the eye stalk in the front. Oh my god. It's so dumb. Yeah, a Walmart Dalek. Been wanting to catch one of you. I keep saying catch, it's record. Recording! <gasps> it called it a bat! It called Ooh. it a musketeer! Can I catch the musketeer? The Fossetier's ability to project powerful streams of pressurized water is tied directly to their emotional state. They are very easily startled and upset. <laughs> they are very easily startled and upset, which leads them to often, to often unexpectedly use their water attacks without intending to. Aww. They're sad little babies. Yeah, I think Ramtasm might be a bit too strong. Oh, I can't catch the Musketeer. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. I've got, yeah, I've got rewinds. Toy. Ooh, it's plastic type. Both of us are at a disadvantage with this. Uh, Squirey, Elfless. Do have a recycled type? Six, come on! Oh, that's at least it's just a trip. Cool. And the CR fan of the group brought it up after like a few months of not talking about it. I made an excited gasp and shook the CR jar. <laughs> Once this. Once some sort of costume, character costume, the Maskatoy is now a closer to a shambling corpse. They are known to shamble endlessly up in the abandoned holes of Fall Down Mall. Their fall, their polyester stuffing slowly leaking out of their bodies. Gross. I love it.
I also shake the jar when he makes a comparison between our campaigns and Critical Role. <laughs> Good! No. Alright, not getting that way. Uh... Does this island have an underground railway network? I'm guessing that this has a this has been here for a while. Hey, Magic Crab. Uh, can you take us back to the cafe real quick? I want to stock up on supplies. Bonjour. Yeah, I'll take a pair of fusi. Fusili. A uh, pair of fusili. I have no idea how to pronounce that. <sighs> okay. How's the party looking? Uh, yeah, we can get away with the rest. Keep dunking on that guy, too, for basically constantly rolling a nat one. <laughs> um... Do you remember what you were doing right before you came here? Like, before you came to New World? Sometimes I try to remember the exact moment, but I can't. It's like trying to remember the moment you fall asleep. I can remember what I was doing around that time, but the exact moment is lost to me. Weird. Another rumor. Oh. Last time I went to East of Woods, a gang of five landkeepers dragged me to their den and drained the life out of me. Honestly, the timeshare presentation was so boring. Thanks for letting me know. Right? And what's worse is that no one talks about this game. This game's designs are so good, and no one talks about it. Can't get up through there. Alright. Maybe the monsters could be extras. I mean, I wouldn't film, you know, think filming a movie here would be a good idea. Wouldn't be a bad idea. It certainly wouldn't be a safe idea. You look cool. Oh, it looks cool! I must have it! We need to be as gentle as possible. I am ten levels above this thing. Oh yeah, Dorian is super dead. Like, he was pastified. One minute, he was there. The next, goo. Insulated. Damn it. Alexa, play Despacito. Okay. Recording. Hey, stop that. <laughs> All right, that knocked him out, so that should shoot the. 77? Yeah! Cool. Orchid. The Orchids were first spotted on New World after the arrival of Fall Down Mall. They have been seen running around, jumping on heads of other monsters, and generally displaying a radical attitude. 
Holy shit! 250 speed? Sweet Jesus! Do I remember the hamster dance? I was there! It be zooming. Zooming's an understatement. That is probably the fastest base speed, in the, base speed in the game. Like, holy shit! Must have been filled with. Must have looked so different, filled with people, right? Well, that's just a death pit. I'd rather not fall down that. I honest, honestly, I kind of want to try one. But it'd also be really, really hard because the specific zones are so large that one recording per zone would actually be incredibly difficult to pull off. Hey, an old book. A ferrochrome tape. A highly efficient tape it has a highly efficient rate when used against middle dips. Hey, take a fucking sip, babes. I shall sip and stretch. I just stepped in. Hmm. It's weird that this shop is empty. Like, there's stuff in it, but there's no one there, you know? All right. Right. No, 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 I see what I have to do. Seems a bit ridiculous for, you know, a mall, but eh, whatever. I dislike MCD's coffee, McD's coffee, it's disgusting. Ugh, fast food coffee in general is just gross. Like, I can barely stomach, like, I barely stomach coffee as it is, and... Ugh, just...
Chrome tape, charge, basic tape. Alright, not bad. Aw, oh, nuts. Can't bring it with me. Oh well. Final beat. I guess this is the place. Should we go inside? Lead the way. Huh. This must be around here. I'm so close. This record has the witch house written on it in big what? red letters. This album art. You found it. Huh? Wait, something's not right. Timeless and strange. That's not the name of the album. This cover art is slightly different, too. This track listing. I don't know these songs. Ah. It's some alternate universe version. Ah, the one I wanted isn't here. I knew I shouldn't have expected anything good to happen to me. Typical. Ah! Ah. Oh, what happened? Blackmore? You okay? Oh, no. The record. I dropped it. Can you see it? Yeah, it's on the other side of the tracks. Oh no. An archangel! What? What? What is that? Why does it look so wrong? It hurts my head just looking at it. Blackmore, it's an archangel, isn't it? I knew I felt it, an emptiness, oh, where our heart should be, it empowers me, I wish to consume it all. Who are you? What are you talking about? Your kind leads such rich lives, but instead you trade it for hollow symbols and artifacts. You exchange something meaningful, but nothing. My castle is filled with all the emptiness you leave behind. Your castle? The mall? Are you serious? This place is a ruin filled with trash. Nothing. It's nothing. Yes, it is nothing. And I am the king of nothing. Come, let me consume your emptiness. Archangel Nowhere Monarch. so easy. It'd be so easy to just give up and die. But that's not me. I'm sick of letting myself down! Blackmore and Meredith's hearts act as one. Ram Telly! Nowhere peasant. Yeah. Uh, he's doing a lot of damage. Bomb voyage! I'm guessing that's fire attribute.
Gotta get rid of these peasants. Oh, boy. My best bet must might be just throw up a wall. Now I definitely need to throw up a wall. Wall up. <sighs> kind of glad that that wall just ate. That they seem to miss a lot. <laughs> but I have got to find a way to get rid of those. To get rid of those minions. At least they can be they can suffer accuracy down. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, because we are. That's what he reminds me of. He looks like the blue meanie from the old, um... From the old, uh, Yellow Submarine vi movie. Not doing a lot of damage. Uh oh. Yeah, about to lose this fusion. Wait, don't I have? I do. I have smelling salts. These will wake me up, and they won't eat my turn. Genuinely feels like battering ram. Yeah, really close. It genuinely feels like battering ram loses a lot of its accuracy the further into a fight you go.
almost. Residence. Oh boy. Did not mean to use elemental wall. It's fine, it's fine. There we go. Mind meld, copycat. Nice. Hey, Squirey's level rank 5! That means we can evolve him. Remix him. Remaster, whatever. Yeah. We did it. We did it? We're alive? We fused? Four and a half seconds. If you wish to leave this land and heed my words and hear my song, you must rise to the task at hand. You must walk the path most long. To the east your wings must fly, to the place only I have known. For that is where my chambers lie, halls now empty and alone. Venture there and head southbound, where your wayward path shall meet. The rest of the song is too quiet to make out. Nice place to have here, pal. But someone of your potential could do a little better, don't you think? Oh. I remember you, and I really don't know how you found yourselves here. Ah. Uh, I realized this was a really trivial thing to come across, come all this way for. And a really stupid thing to nearly die over. You didn't have to do this. Thanks, mate. I think... I've had enough abandoned malls and mortal peril for today. Come on, let's go back to town and check this record out. Uh... So, the whole fusion thing? I felt like we should uh, talk about it. It's pretty weird, right? It's certainly... something? It's like our minds merge, and I'm no longer me. Afterwards, while I still remember it, it doesn't feel like it's something that I experienced. It's like remembering a dream. Maybe our brains just aren't equipped to process um... it. Have you, uh, fused with anyone before? But not that it's a big deal if you have. Just wasn't sure if that was your first time. This is, uh, coming out all wrong. Uh, yeah. Forget I said anything. Oh, um... no. Meredith is adorable. I've been meaning to ask. What makes you sure... What makes you so sure that you have a way home? I had a vision. Uh, you're gonna have to tell me the full story here, mate. Huh. Huh. That's pretty wild. I'll uphold my end of the bargain. You help me find a record, I'll help, I'll help you find a way off New World. Oh. oh, I almost forgot about the record. <laughs> this is pretty good. I mean, it's not the same album I used to have, but it's familiar enough. I uh, spent my teen years being very miserable and bad with people. When I went to college, I wanted to change, for real. The record was kind of like a sound, was kind of the soundtrack to me, like trying to change and get better. Not that I did. I almost made lifelong friends, but they don't speak to me anymore. I know it's me who's the problem, but I want to keep trying. Maybe that's what the Archangel meant? Maybe I've spent too much time distracting myself with stuff instead of trying to actually live. 
but even if we didn't find exactly what I was looking for, I'm okay with this outcome. You didn't need to risk your life to help me. A lot sucks about New World, but... Oh, kinda cool. Oh, shucks. Fusion is now available in regular battles when partnered with Meredith. Fusions you form with Meredith have a 5% increased strike. Um... What do you think the deal is with the triangle blow? I don't trust anyone with a geometric shape for a head. Oh, uh, you wanted to ask my opinion on a lead you were chasing? Go on then, what is it? Venture there and head southbound, where your wayward paths shall meet. Sounds like it's pointing in a direction, I guess? I guess we better get back to adventuring. Didn't you hear some rumors about something happening in Cherry Meadow? That might be a good place to check out. True enough. Bonjour. What's on the menu? You know what? I'll take another pair of fusilli. Au revoir. I'm also going to hit take a quick rest so we can finally remaster Squirey! I'm trying to make small talk with Meredith, but she's not very talkative at the moment. Fair enough. In the heat of battle, what is mo which is more important to you, honor or victory? Honor. Your squirey became Palangolin! The Palangolin is, a mis is the mature form of a squirey who has remained true to their principles and has become a knight of great virtue. Palangolins wield, a s wield striking gold halberds, which they use to defend their allies in the heat of battle. It's a pretty decent boy. Not sure where the music went. All right. But that's going to be it for tonight. Thank you all very much for watching. I will be back Friday. But until then, remember, you can't get good if you're busy being mad. Stay awesome, stay safe, and thank you very much for visiting the basement. You all have a wonderful night. <laughs>